I was raised in the truth and had good spiritual examples in my family that helped me to set goals at a young age. Progressed to baptism in my teen years, also started regular pioneering as a teenager. But uh, I started hanging around the wrong crowd, uh, inside the congregation first and then bad association outside. Partying, heavy drinking, uh, living a double life. I knew I couldn't continue that and stay at home because my parents were still serving Jehovah faithfully. So I decided to move out and go into the world 100% because I just wanted to have fun. Well, with nothing holding me back, the party and the heavy drinking led to experimenting with drugs, uh, living in a moral lifestyle. The lifestyle in the world was pretty much work all week to party on the weekend, and that's what we did. But uh, eventually saw that that uh, was just a vicious cycle. Eventually, uh, things got to the point where I started having money problems, losing work, uh, lost my license at one point, lost my apartment, couldn't pay the rent. And so I knew uh, this was not the way to true happiness and I was miserable. I thought back to the time I was the happiest and that's when I was serving Jehovah full time. And I wanted that back. So I poured my heart out to Jehovah in prayer and you know, let him know that I wanted to return to him. I knew from personal experience that if you break a bone, such as your arm, you need help. You need to see a doctor. Uh, only they are qualified to fix it, set the bone right so it can heal. I knew I had to seek out the elders because they're trained spiritual doctors. They know how to use the scriptures to help you heal. So I, I went to them because I wanted to return to Jehovah. Now, I didn't even have dress clothes anymore. I'd lost all that. Just went back with jeans and a t-shirt. My parents didn't even know I was coming, but I showed up at the meeting anyway. Uh, the elders, when I met with them, they were so loving and kind and patient. I've learned firsthand that Jehovah's discipline, it's for the best. Yeah, it's true, it may hurt, it may sting initially, but if we allow ourselves to be molded and trained by it, it'll always work out for the best. I'm so glad I made the decision to return to Jehovah. And Jehovah, he blessed me with the happiness that I longed for, but a lot more. Yeah, privileges of service I never would have imagined. And I've experienced through Jehovah's discipline, his greatest quality, love. And I've never been happier. <laughs>